Decided you'd like some tires after all? You do? Splendid. The next step is getting some support in writing. I don't expect you to ask every person in Eastminster on my behalf. But if you can convince enough of them, I'll accept my role as official leader. Five? Surely you must be joking. We'll need more than that. If you can secure support from a lot of respectable community figures, I'll see what I can do my side. What can I get for you? I've actually got some work for you, mate, if you're interested. I need you to go to the brewery and pick me up a specific keg of ale, Stella at home. Bring it back here and swap it out for the empty keg. We have a real picky customer who won't drink anything else. I tell him to get bent, but he has connections. Basically, if you don't get what he wants, then we don't get protection. It's that simple. Yeah, but them's the brakes. I'm trying to run a business here, and they keep us out of trouble. I can't say the Tommies at the gate would do the same. I've actually got some work for you, mate, if you're interested. I need you. We have a real... Basically, if it... You're a lifesaver. Cheers. And what do you want? My story? Well, there ain't much to tell. Dad was a gentry paper pusher. I never met my mum. Decided one day I was sick of the bullshit and left. Wanted to live like a person, you know? Yeah, it's way more fun. I won't be here forever, though. One day, I'll join the Pistols in Camden. They know how to live life. And what do you want? Why are you dressed like that? Toby? The tyre seller? Well, his tyres are fairly priced, sure. Why not? Hey there. So that's what those ballots are for. Hmm, I can't think of anyone else who'd be better suited. So sure. At all. Toby? He's a bit meddlesome, ain't he? Ugh. I guess it's only because he cares. I suppose he's all right. Okay, I'll sign. Yes? Hi, how are you? Yeah? Huh? Good day to you, sir. Are you mad? 400 tickets for a measly pistol? It's not just a pistol. If you knew anything about guns, you'd know that. I know more about guns than you do. This conversation is over. Bye. <clears throat> Can you believe that guy? What a rip-off. Not really. But I know that 500 tickets is too much to spend on a bloody pistol. The fifth column has been providing food and supplies. Don't know much about them, but I like that girl, Eve. Sure. Looking for anything in particular? 
Ruggs thinks he knows more about guns than I do. I serve my time in the Tommies, as an officer no less. Can he say the same? He claims to have some sort of special training. Ridiculous. Only the best. Looking for anything in particular? Eastminster could use a strong leader. A little too close for comfort, mate. Fish, fresh fish, and strawberries, fresh strawberries. Isn't Toby already the leader of Eastminster? I see. Well, Toby's a good man. Sells great tyres. Sure, I'll sign. Yes? That's an interesting thought. Maybe if Eastminster had an official leader, things would finally change around here. Sure. I'll sign. Hello there. Excuse me. I'm very sorry to bother you, but I have nobody else I can ask. Thank you for listening. I've tried to ask everyone, but nobody even notices me. I know you don't really know me or probably care about my plight, but I think my parents have been using chems. Like, a lot of them. They promised me they had cleaned up, but I think they've been lying. But I'm not apt enough to check anything out. Can you help? They retreat into their rooms late at night, and by the morning they look terrible. I've seen them twitching a lot recently, too. They've been abusing chems in the past before, so it's not outside the realms of possibility that they are doing it again. Well, my parents always lock their footlocker up tight whenever they're out of the house or asleep. I was caught trying to get into it several times before, so now it's always locked. Will you help me? Plenty of reasons, but checking their lockbox would confirm it. I've searched everywhere else already. Thank you. I hope I'm wrong, but I need to know. What's up? I knew Toby from the Good Samaritans. I know he wants what's best. Don't know what difference having an official leader would make, but sure. I'll endorse Toby. 
This isn't cooking. This is a fucking waste of human life. Hi. How are you? Yes? Hello, I'm Miss Abigail Bruner, the school teacher in Eastminster. Yes, it's just me. Occasionally parents will volunteer to help out. Usually they don't have time, though. Just about. All but Darius and his little... gang. I'm not, actually. I was born in Westminster, if you'd believe it. However, my dad was not. He was from outside the walls. Sure, I like it enough. I'd like it more if I had some help. And maybe some money. Oh, but the kids are sweet, though. Toby? I know Toby. He's the chap always going on about tires. Why does Eastminster need an official leader, though? Things have been improving since the fifth column moved in. I'm not sure if that's true, but I'll sign for Toby. However, I need you to do something first. I've been going over the great buildings of London in class and would love to show my students Somerset House. The thing is, a group of hooligans recently claimed it as their own. If you'd be so kind as to deal with the situation for me, I'd be happy to endorse Toby. You've never been to Somerset House. Where were you educated? It's a gorgeous neoclassical building with a beautiful sprawling courtyard. Oh, do go take a look. If not for the children, for yourself. Oh, when you put it like that, it sounds terrible. But remember, you'll be doing a service in the name of education. Oh, I do hope you're successful.
Go back to your own kind, human. Welcome, My friend. Hounds learn to swim. To see you. So proud of them.
If you're dining, please take a seat, or you can order drinks at the bar. Yeah, it's a pub. Bum How the fuck did you cock up an apple tart? It's a tart! If you're dining, please take a seat, or you can order drinks at the bar. Oh, I adore Toby. Such a nice chap. He always orders food when he comes in. He sees the potential of this place. It could be so much more than a watering hole. I'd love to sign for Toby, but I need a favor first. If this place is ever going to be more than a pub, I need to serve more than just fish and chips. I saved up and put a food order in with Marley and Wilma, but it still hasn't arrived. Would you go and check on it for me? Save the Queen.
Hi, how are you? Looking for anything in particular? Only the best. If you're buying, I'm sick. Do you need something? Yeah, cool. Whatever you want. Hello, and welcome to Griffith's Sale. You've arrived, as you can see. The stitching is reminiscent of works from an earlier era. Let's start this off. Hmm. I suppose I've always thought of him as the leader anyways. Sure, why not? Did you have any luck? Splendid. Oh, thank you so much. I know the kids will really appreciate it. Here's that signature you asked for. And this is for you. I hope it brings you luck. How are those endorsements coming along? Let me have a look. It appears there is a consensus. I am officially the leader of Eastminster. This calls for a speech. The people of Eastminster asked Toby the Tire Man to be their official leader, and I accepted. It is with great honour that I stand before you today. Eastminster deserves a voice, and I am proud to be it. Just as I am proud to announce the return of the Good Samaritans. No longer will we be dependent on the charity of others. Together, we will forge a new Eastminster. I wanted to thank you again. This wouldn't have been possible without you. That was the last we saw of Camelot. It was the last we saw of the Good Samaritans, too. Lost too many people. The void that was left was filled by the fifth column. We don't quite know what their angle is. All I do know is that Eastminster deserves more than to be a pawn in someone else's game. Hmm, yes. A few of the original members are still around. And there's a few new people that I think might be interested. Here's a list. Would you speak to them and see if they're game? Thank you. Seriously. That was some speech, wasn't it? Me? I'm a former Tommy officer. Doubt they'd want me to. He did? Well then, report my acceptance. Yeah?
Did you see Toby up there on the steps? Me? Oh, no. I'm joining the pistols in Camden. I'm not exactly good Samaritan material. Because, have you seen me? I look like them. I do suppose that's pretty superficial, though. Shit. Maybe you're right. All right. Fine. Count me in. Just delighted for Toby. Me? But who would greet new visitors? Oh, well in that case, sure. I love being part of groups. I'm in. I heard Toby's speech. He's bringing back the Good Samaritans. It's a beautiful day in Eastminster. Did you hear Toby's speech? I can't believe the Good Samaritans are coming back. I don't know. My father used to be in the Good Samaritans. It didn't go well for him. That's pretty presumptuous, seeing as how you never met my dad. Uh, the annoying thing is that you're right. He believed in the Good Samaritans. And you know what? So do I. I may regret this. But all right, I'll join. What's the verdict? <sighs> I can't tell you how happy that makes me. Eastminster is now one step closer to being autonomous. Thank you. <laughs>